please click on the subscribe button and click on the bell icon to get the latest notifications hello everyone it's me JB from unique tutorials today in this video I will show how to get the desktop web browser like tabs for your file explorer so let me show you first so this is your default file explorer so you can see your default file explorer as you can see this is your default file explorer so there is no tabs like you can see in the desktop web browser so you can see this kind of tabs in your desktop web browser so how to get this kind of tabs in your computer's file explorer so without any further more delay let's begin so first of all what you need to do is open any web browser and go to this website I'll be providing this website link in the video descriptions too so you can click there too and log into this website so once you log into this website you can see its web page so here you can see try it free and pricing and buy so firstly I would highly recommend to try it free because the free versions to offer you a lot of options so you click on try it free and download this software So once the download is complete, you install this software. So after successful installations, you click on start now. Wait for a few seconds. So you can see your default file explorer has finally got a new looks that is like a tab browsing. So you can see here so what's the speciality about this software is that you can see it won't create new file explorer it will just give you some extra options like let me click you and open my computer so you can see here so what's the usefulness of this explorer max software is that you can see here a thumbnail that is what what folder files you have used or opened today you can check out using the time dial and using the dual fan what you can do is when you click on the dual fan wait for a few seconds so you can create a dual layout and and this feature is very useful when you are copying from one drive to other drive or one folder to the other folder so it will be very useful so you can just create a dual pane and if you click on the time now you can see today's what were the files you have opened everything like documents pictures programs you can check out everything like that so in this way it's very useful and you will get the other options like as before so you can see here a choice 
current options do is exactly the same as your Windows charts functions so the special about this is that you can see here there's more themes to customize depending upon your needs if you want to modify it and click on customize you can make it a duck if you don't need then you can put it as the normal or adaptive and even to make it run all the time when you restart your computer what you need to do is you can see here an option that is a menu then you need to go to the settings in the settings you can see here is default tick mark as long set windows boot if it is untick so tick mark it and run explorer when you open a folder you can run it and if you don't need this explorer max again then what you need to you can do is you can close this port you can close those things you can just do you can just exit it like that so in this way too you can exit it and if you want it again then you can enable it again so in my opinion i think you should definitely use this explorer max in day to day life users because it will gonna help you and make your daily tasks much easier and smarter so in my opinion you should definitely try it and use it in your windows computer because in everyday tasks it will help you a lot so if you find this video information useful click on the thumbs like button and if you're new to our channel click on the subscribe button and lastly thanks for watching